Hello everyone, this is Condus12 with Connor Productions and People. We are going over Griffin's movesets and Max Punishes. This is going to be a short and sweet video straight to the point because I hate guides that take all day to explain. So we're going to go through his entire moveset. Let's not waste any more time and let's get in there. Griffin's Lights causes 12 damage on all sides. He can also do a double tap light when connected, causing an extra 3 damage. And he has a third light chain with undodgeable properties that cause an extra 14 damage. Griffin has an alternative light chain that you can attack all three different sides, which will cause 12, 13, then 14 damage. All of Griffin's light finishers are undodgeable. Heavies cause 24 damage on all sides. You can chain heavy up to three times, causing 25 and 30 damage on side heavies. For top heavy finishers, it causes 32 damage. And all of Griffin's heavy finishers has hyper armor. Griffin has a four dash light attack, causing 14 damage. This can chain into a second light attack. He also has a four dash heavy attack, causing 22 damage, chaining into another heavy. Both of these attacks can be mixed up with heavies and lights. Griffin has a side dodge attack causing 16 damage that can go into a light attack. This move can also chain into a heavy. Griffin's zone causes 15 damage. His zone can start a light chain. It can even start a heavy chain. Griffin even has a bash from neutral. The bash gets a guaranteed light going into a light chain. The bash can even go into a heavy chain. After any second attack, you can go into a special move called Veteran's Kick, which grants you a guaranteed heavy, dealing 28 damage. You can start this move from light chains, heavy chains, Zone into light or heavy chains. And here's an interesting one. You can go into Veteran's Kick after a side dodge. Both forward dodge attacks can also go into Veteran's Kick. After guard breaking, you can use Veteran's Kick, but it's not guaranteed. You have a heavy sprint attack called Dauntless Chase, which flips your opponent, very similar like Lawbringer's Long Arm. This causes 10 damage. For Guard Break Punish, it is a heavy. It deals the same damage on all three sides. Light Parry Punish is top heavy. Heavy Parry Punish is double light. For Wall Splat Punish, it is top heavy. Guard Break out of Stamina Punish is throw into 4 dash light, to kick, top heavy, for a total of 42 damage. Out of Stamina Parry Punish is zone, top light, and kick, to top heavy, dealing 56 damage. Here is an alternative out of Stamina Parry Punish, but the kick is not guaranteed. It is top light to top heavy, to kick to top heavy, dealing 68 damage. So you're able to feign all of his heavies any direction, but his side dodge heavy and his four dodge heavies cannot be fainted. Alright everyone, that is a wrap for this video. Thank you so much for watching. And people, if I missed anything, feel free to comment down below what I missed and I'll pin it so people can see it. We'll see you next time guys. God bless.